Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in the original Torchlight. We are going to continue our adventure. We have just come out of the mines. If you haven't watched the previous episode, you should go back and watch them now. There should be a link popping up here shortly. Uh, so I'm going to do some spoilers here. So if you haven't seen them close out now, go back and watch them, and then we'll see you in a little bit. So at the end of the last episode, we made it down to the Dank Chamber with Brink, and we found Master Alric, who's been corrupted by the Ember. He, in turn, corrupted Brink, so we had to fight to the death. We killed him, sadly. Uh, and Sil came down, and now we are back in the town of Torchlight, uh, trying to regroup and figure out what we need to do next. So we've come out of the portal. You can see that here. And we got a gentleman here with a quest. Level 10, Hatch. Let's see what he has to say. Hey there, stranger. Welcome to Torchlight. I'm Hatch, richest man in town. Well, that's my plan anyhow. I haven't worked out all the details yet, but the key is key is this here wand. It opens a portal to one particular spot, and I'm sure it must be full of treasure. Problem is, it's also full of monsters, so I can't have a look for myself. If you can handle the monsters and bring me the best treasure you find there, you can keep any gold and weapons for yourself. Be careful, though. I don't think any other portals will be working there. What do you say? Sure, we'll take the... The wand, so we can go down the portal. Uh, I don't think we're gonna do that just quite yet. Let's go ahead and do some other things in town here. We need to bring the ember back to the gentleman over here whose name I have forgotten. Vasman. All right, let's go talk what to him. Ah, I've seen you found the gleaming ember. I hope it wasn't too much trouble. Here is your reward. This is fine, a clear piece, but it's still there is something odd about it. All the ember from Torchlight seems to have a special quality. Well, I'll soon understand it better. All right. Ooh, and he's got another quest. And he's got some friends here. Gorn and Furl were not here when we first came in. And nor was this guy. Looks like we got some gambling. Sell unidentified magic items. Okay. So let's go back to Vastman. Hello. Ember is the essence of magic, and it assumes aspects of its environment. That is why ember from different locations can appear and behave completely differently. Oh, huh, interesting. I've heard of a vast necropolis buried below the mines. Deathlace ember can sometimes be found in such places. Studying such a rare type of ember is a long-held dream of mine. You'll bring me any you find, won't you? Of course we will. So we'll go ahead and accept that quest. Yes, yes, we have begun a new quest. A chance item, so let's go back and find... Who do we got here? Trillbot, 4,000. Inspiring Bard. I am the great Bard Trill. Perhaps you've heard of me? No? That's the problem, really. Despite my astonishing talent, word of my ascendancy has not yet spread among the masses. <laughs> kind of like my YouTube channel. My ability is beyond question, but perhaps I have not yet found a tale truly worth telling. Perhaps your heroic deeds will inspire me. A beast known as Varserk has been emerging at night to prowl about Torchlight. He is said to be a bat-like creature of great power. His lair is said to be on the third floor of the mine. Slay him, and I will immortalize you. Immortalize your battle in verse. Okay, we'll accept that. Uh, where is Syl? There she is. All right, so let's talk to her. I'm a bit overwhelmed, friend. Brink is dead. My master is lost. I feel responsible for your corruption as well. Somehow the blighted ember is fusing with your flesh, changing it. But at least the progress is slow. I have some knowledge of the crypts below the mine. The overseer experimented with methods of purifying ember. You may be able to use his knowledge to purge the corruption from you now. Find the overseer's library. His notes should be there. Well, of course we want to save ourselves, so we will take that quest gladly. So let's finish exploring the town. A couple more people. Who do we got here? I don't think the blacksmith was here originally. All right, so it looks like we've done just about everything in town. Let's see what we have in our inventory. Uh, let's go ahead and identify these items. See if any of these are what we want to use. Oops. All right, so we can sell that. We can sell that. What is this? Brooms, Rhone, Hide, Tonic. Uh, so yeah, we will definitely drink that. Increase our defense by two. All right, so this copper ring, 3% faster cast speed. 
increasing experience gain. So we don't really want that. Four armor plus two armor. Eh. Okay. Six plus armor plus three fire resistance. Knockback increases all ice damage. Okay, we will take these shoulder pads. Perfect. Put those on. And we have a shield, but we are going to specialize in dual wielding, so we'll pass on that. But we have the Adept Chaos Gem. Um, not really what we need, so let's go to one of these people. We can see what we can sell them. So let's go, I think, is it Shift to sell? Yeah, okay, so we can go ahead and sell that gem. What else do we got? Fireball, there's a bunch of stuff we could buy here, but we're not really into spell casting, so we'll ignore that. Sells enchanted items. Uh, or no, enchant items, so we don't want to do that. Let's go over here and sell the rest of our Junkolas. Alright, so sell, sell, sell. Perfect. Ooh, we got quite a bit of gold. Uh, do we want to buy anything here? We got plenty of health potions, plenty of mana potions. What's this ring? Oh, that's the one I just sold. Uh, I think we're good. We'll just go over here and see what these guys have to sell. Destroys items, recovers gems inside, destroys gems and socketed items. Sells on and off energy. Well, let's see what he has to sell. Let's... Do we want to buy... Price 780. Sure, let's buy a hatchet. Just for funsies. Alright, so it does 34 damage. Okay, I think that was a good buy. And we'll just go ahead and switch out that. No, excuse me. Switch out that. Because that has the gems on it already. So we'll go ahead and sell that back to him. Alright. Let us head back to the portal and head down into the necropolis. So our goal... We got two things we need to do down here, quest-wise. Let's open up the quest panel here so we can review. Uh, skills, character sheet, where's quest that? Pet sheet, quest, here we go. All right, so we need to go down the hatch. Um, oops, nope, not that one. A cure for corruption, so we need to find the Overseer's Library, and we also need to find the Death Lace Ember. So let us head back into there. Yep, travel to the Dank Chamber, perfect. If you guys have been enjoying this content, don't forget to leave a like. Comment on down below what you think of Torchlight if you've been playing it, what you think of the story so far. Kind of an interesting twist early on with Brink dying, but that's okay. Let's head down the stairs here. Uh, if you really like the content, don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time and in orderly fashion. This vault was rightly sealed. It was an experiment as ill-fated as my own. Their ancestors are animated not with life, but with the same dark energy that flows through the ember veins. Separating out the vileness is impossible. Immortality lies forever beyond our reach. I was a fool to think otherwise. All right, the Tomb of the Wake and fourth or fifth floor. Let's see, we got some pale shamblers, a corrupted shambler. All right, well, let's crush it. Ooh, that spider just got zapped. All right, let's go over here and crush these guys, some archers. Okay, so this new sword we bought, pretty good. Ooh, let's dodge, let's go get this guy here first, this mage, a rotted chanter, and he is gone now. And these guys are dropping poison clouds. Okay, let's get out of that. And smashy, smashy. Let's bring our specter out here to help us. Another pale shambler to knock back. All right. Nice. We survived this first part. Let's go ahead and get these guys. And they're going to drop their poisonous clouds. Let's get out of this. There we go. All right. Zombies down. Gold picked up. Fan. Fantastic, fantastic indeed. I like this level design so far. Certainly a little bit more uh, dungeon crawler-esque. Not the, the same as the mine, but that's okay. So let's head back this way, or head over this way. And we can take a left here. Cross this bridge. Who do we got here? Grave robber, ooh. Honor skeleton. So Okay, so he spawns people. Deathlace Ember, perfect, just what we need, and an armor rack. Man, everything right here. 
Back across this bridge, a little gold, a bunch of skeletons over here. Let's smashy smashy. Perfect. Alright, go smash this barrel open. A little bit more gold. Some gold over here we need to grab. What do you got? Another skeleton warrior. Dropping me a health potion. Thank you, sir. Oop, another enchanter. Rot enchanter, sorry. He goes away. Perfect. Fishing hole. Oh, we can do some fishing. All right, let's see if we catch anything here. Was I too slow? Too slow. All right, let's try one more time. Yeah, I caught nothing. Thank you. Do I have to wait for it to bite a couple times? Or do I have to get it right on the bite? Okay, I must have to get it right on the bite. Let's see here. Bite again. Nothing? Alright, well, apparently I'm not very good at fishing. Let's continue on here. Smooth boar, we'll pick that up so we can sell that later. Another zombie to crush. Looks like he poisoned us, but that's okay. Get rid of this guy here. Ooh, and we leveled up. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of this skeleton warrior. And then we'll level up. Alright, down he goes. Go ahead and go to our character sheet first and add our stats. Hmm. Um, damage by. So we've been doing some magical damage. Let's go ahead and add a little there. And then we'll increase our strength to 20. And we got one point remaining. So let's we'll just throw it on dexterity. Good. All right. And now for our skill. Let's see. Dual wielding. We could increase the damage of our dual wielding. Stampede. Uh, brutal flash dash towards the enemy. Okay, that's cool. What do we got here? Titan Stomp. Blast all nearby foes with a shockwave that damages and knocks them back. All right, let's go ahead and purchase Titan Stomp. That sounds pretty cool. And we're going to add that to here. Titan Stomp. And let's just see what that looks like. All right, cool. Knocks everything back. So we got to remember to use that. Ooh, what's this? A Phase Beast. Phase Beast no more. Phase portal. Okay, we're going to go down the phase portal to the lost chamber, and there is quite a bit here. Um, might have been a poor idea. Uh, let's not die. Your health is too low. Yeah, I know. I'm hitting one here. Uh, we might not survive, guys. Let's, let's do a little kiting here. Uh, let's see if we can get out of here. All right. Woo! That was quite dangerous, but we... Got some stuff out and got the hell out of dodge before we were able to get killed. Okay, let's not do that again for a little bit. Uh, identify scroll we will take. Smash this barrel. Ooh, there's a skeleton in there. Um, okay, there's a lot of stuff over here. Let us back away and drink a mana potion. Alright, back this way we go. Crushy, crushy. And phase stomp for the boot stomp. Get out of the poison cloud for a second. Let that disappear here. All right, let's go take care of this guy. Out of the poison cloud again. Just run there, run back, run there, run back. All right, that's going down good. Wooden hammer we'll pick up. Uh, something the vengeful. Um, he does not look like he is very friendly. So let's... Um, Summon our ghost friend here. He can help us here. How are we doing health? We're doing fine still. He is almost down. Alright, nice. We killed him. Knock out that zombie there. Let him do his thing. So we increased our fame. So we got another skill point. Very nice. Let's go ahead and increase, since I use it a lot. Let's go ahead and increase the slash attack. Get a little more damage from that. Very nice. All right. What do we got loot-wise? Mana potion will take an identified boot, an identified pistol. Some gold over here. A big pile of gold. Health potion. We found a secret door, apparently, uh, with some blobs in it. Let's go ahead and knock out this guy. There he goes, away from the poison cloud. Why that poison cloud is doing its thing. Let's go ahead and identify the boots. Hardened buckled sword uh, with a win. Poison resistance, three armor. Okay, we will put those boots on because they're better than what we're wearing now. 
Oh, but do we not have a high enough level? Dexterity 10. Okay, so we're not quite there. Get rid of this zombie. Alright, mana potion, health potion. Let's go take care of these. Slashy, slashy. And there's only one guy left. Let's get rid of him. Perfect. Alright, chest. Mana potion. Beautiful. Oops. And it lit me on fire. Collect all this gold. Alright. Ooh, another party down here. Alright, let's go kill what we can. Stomp everything away. Get out of the poison cloud for a second. Let them come up here. Resummon our friend. Knock those guys out. Let's just run through the cloud. There's a health po potion portal thing there. Another big old uh, troll we need. Let's get rid of this caster first. Okay, caster's gone. Just get rid of that zombie. Skeleton was hiding there. We'll get rid of these zombies over here. Alright, perfect. Leather armor. Get that. We'll get this. Let's get rid of the skeleton warrior. Alright, I think we got rid of everything other than the big scary guy. Nope, nope. He's still got some friends, but not as many. Alright, so let's go take care of... Ooh, we just obliterated him. Alright. We have no mana. Alright, drink a mana potion. Let's keep slicing and dicing while that mana potion builds up. He's almost gone. Good. 380 fame. Perfect. Collect all that. We are just slicing and dicing and serving everyone on rice. Drink another mana potion here. Go ahead and go to the Shrine of Healing and get healed up. And we'll head back up these stairs. A couple more people we need to take care of. A little gold for us. Beautiful. Mimic. It is not a mimic. And no fire. Very nice. Another skeleton warrior to crush. Our pot to crush. Grave digger we need to go take care of here soon. Quit spawning skeletons there, bud. Alright, all those guys are crushed now. What do we got in here? Just a room. Alright, let's take care of all these. Perfect. Smash that. Anything we need to loot in here? No? Alright. Back out here. Pick up the identifying scroll. Let's check out the other side. This is a big old crypt. There's a lot of people in here. Okay, bye bye skeleton archer. Drop the big old boot stomp, but we don't have any mana. Start smashing all these guys. A lectern. Ooh, wow, that is a lot of stuff. Did we get a spell scroll? Uh, where'd it go? I thought we picked up a spell scroll. Maybe not. Or is it under here? Okay, here we go. Uh, elemental protection one requires level one casters buffed by increased elemental resistance. We'll hang on to that. We might use that for us. That's a good thing for a berserker to get a little extra protection. All right, deeper into the crypts we go. Zombie to kill. Get rid of this caster. Oops. And then a grave robber we need to get. Ooh, there's a lot of spiders here. Okay. Big boot stomp. And a bunch of the spiders go away. Mana potion we'll take. An identified ring we'll take. Take that. Alright. Another big scary guy. Rock Tripper the Cutter. Let's see if we can get some of these shambles to come up here. Oh, let's do the boot stomp. Push all those guys back. Slice as many of these we can. Let's get out of the poison cloud. Smash this. Take that gold. All right, so we found the end of the map, but there's still quite a bit we haven't explored. S totally got rid of that guy. Let's go ahead and crush this guy. Except we need to go ahead and drink a mana potion. How we doing? Oops. Let's get back over here. All right, he's about half health. We're still doing good on health, but we have no mana. Drink another mana potion. Alright, down he goes. Another troll crushed under our blades. Okay, so we must be out of room. Let's uh, clean up these guys first, and then we'll deal with not having any room. Alright, just 
two more guys. Him and the shamble. Perfect. All right. Loot the chest. Oop, it's a mimic. Crushy, crushy. Beautiful. All right, get all this stuff. All right, so let's look at our inventory, and we'll pull up our pet's inventory. Uh, let's get all this stuff over there, because we're not going to use any of it. That can go over there. Stone mace, 78 damage, but it, it's one hand. Man, that's a lot of damage per second. Um, yeah, we're going to get rid of this dull blade. All right, sell that, sell that. This we can move up here, here. Um, 10 dexterity. Let's go ahead and identify. I know I'm not going to use that. We can identify the leather armor. All right, so this is 9 plus 2 ice resistance, so we'll take that. We can put that in our pet to go sell. Probably, let's see, ordinary blade. All right, well, we will go ahead and identify this. Identify this. Identify the rings. All right, so we can that can go over there. Uh, three armor. Nope, sell that. Do do do. Fifty damage per second. One-handed physical. Eighteen to thirty plus three percent attack speed. Um, all right, we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna get rid of this. Even though it does more damage, I like the buffs from that. Let's look at these rings here. Plus two mana. Eh. Twelve electrical resistance. And, all right, so let's get rid of the insulated copper ring. Pet's inventory is full. Okay, so he needs to go sell some stuff. So let's send him back to sell everything. All right, he's going to go sell. While he does that, we can go ahead and loot this stuff. Anything else that needs to be looted? No? Okay, close that. While he's selling, we can go ahead and backtrack because there's still quite a bit of this level of the dungeon to explore. So we're gonna backtrack here. He's getting off, Tooth is getting all of his steps and I guess Scrub is as well. Oops, we missed the pot here, get a little gold from that. All right, nice that all this is cleared and is not respawning. Again, if you guys have enjoyed this content, don't forget to like the video, comment on down below. Start thinking of new games. We're kind of playing Torchlight, we're playing the final station. Uh, oops, okay, we just walked in to a trap. By accident, let's um, let's get rid of all these guys here. Summon our friend, because he's gonna help us. All right, perfect. There's the lever. Is our dog getting his butt whooped in there? All right, let's go save him. Let's do the boot stomp here. I opened the door, didn't I? All right, boom. They all go down. All right, so those guys are all down. Let's go back this way for a second. Get away from those shambling rights. Is there anything in here we can loot? Nope, just more of this. All right. So let's see what we can do about this shambling right problem we apparently have. Get away from that poison cloud. All right, let's just go ahead and take care of all these guys. Boot stomp. They are stunned. Not really losing that much health. I think it's just draining my mana. So I think if we get away from here, drink ourselves a mana potion, and we'll just go ahead and regular melee these guys down. Great. Uh, mana potion we'll get. Let's go smash this barrel. Looks like there's another troll. Uh, right Eater the Relic. Let's go uh, show him who's boss here. All right, oof, he hits hard. And we're already out of mana. We'll drink another mana potion here. He is just summoning spiders left and right. That's okay. Another big attack here. There we go. Level four. Very nice. Let's loot up his stuff. That health potion. Okay. Mimic or chest? Mimic or chest? I'm going to say mimic. Oop. Nope. It is a trap. Let's go ahead and get rid of these skeletal knights. Down he goes off the edge. We'll never see his bones again. All right, oops. All right, loot this stuff here, beautiful. We are just rocking and rolling, my friends. Slaying, snapping necks, and cashing checks. And we still got quite a bit of the, the crypt to explore here. And we need to level up, so let's go ahead and level up. 
What do we need for those boots? Dexterity, level 10. So let's get this up to 10. And we'll get magic up to, I guess, 9. So we can close that out. As for our skill... Um, let's go ahead and upgrade our friend. Because he does a lot. And I think maybe next time we start getting some more passive skills. Yeah, I think next time maybe we get either the armor or the, the weapon passive skill. All right, let's backtrack some more. Do da, do da. Cross this bridge, away we go. Do, 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 do. You missed that. Get that gold there. And our lovely dog Scrubs is healing us. I don't think we went up these stairs, did we? No, we, we did not. There are still a lot of friends up here for us to take care of. And a bunch more coming down, so let's go ahead and do boot stomp. And start slashing these guys. Slash, slash, slash. Another boot stomp. Oh, we're out of mana. Alright, so we need to improve our mana regain because we cannot quite keep up with this. Alright, let's get him there. Is that everyone? Alright, that's everyone. Let's go ahead and loot up what we can. Got one more friend over here that wants to play. Trusty pistol, health potion. Two more friends. He goes down. And he goes down as well. Very nice. Oh, we are full up on inventory. Alright. Do, do, do. Let's go ahead and open up Tooth and Scrubs' inventory. So we're gonna, we know we're gonna sell this. Gonna sell that, gonna sell that. Tainted Focus, yep, sell that, sell that. Um, oh, we're gonna switch that ring there, beautiful. Sell that, sell that. Can put these boots on, so those boots can be sold. Let's go ahead, yeah, we're not gonna identify the shield, not gonna identify that, that. Or that. Let's go ahead and identify the chest plates and see what we're working with here. Eight armor, increase all ice damage by 3%. Nine armor plus two mana. I do need more mana, so let's go ahead and switch that out. And that can go there. Perfect. And what do we got? Health potion, mana potion, health potion. We skip anything over here? Nope. All right, down the stairs. And let's go explore the rest of the dungeon. Or the, yeah, the dungeon, the crypt, whatever this was called. Alright, so now we're over here, and I think we can take a right. Yeah, okay. Smash this barrel. 20 gold. Perfect. What do we got over here? Just an empty platform? Man, we came all this way. There we go. Alright, let's boot stomp these guys. Most of them went flying. Do a little AoE attack. Crush those guys. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, oops, one more friend. All right, and that was that. They all perished to our blade. I get everything that looks like it. I think this is the the last of it. Let's just go check back over here, make sure we didn't miss any corners or bridges. Nope, I think this is the stairs up. Perfect. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me today in Torchlight. We're going to go ahead and end the episode here. Again, if you've liked the content, don't forget to like the video. If you want to comment on down below, really on anything, you know, a couple of you guys have been giving me some good feedback. Still always looking for feedback on video quality, commentary quality, audio quality, anything like that. We're at 109 subscribers at the time of the recording, so I want to get better, so let me know how to get better. And obviously, if you want to see me improve, don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time in an orderly fashion. Again, thank you so much for joining me today in Torchlight, and we'll see you in the next video.